Hello, today we're going to install SourceMaker Office 2018 for Linux Beta. Basically, let's start with the downloading process first before I speak about why this is a quite a big step for Linux. So, we go to free beta version and it works slightly different than our normal Linux based systems because we have to give in a name, our name, country and emails because they're going to send you a product key to activate it. Isn't that crazy? It is not so much fun. I'm going to use South Africa because I'm South African even though I'm living in Russia at the moment. And type in our email. You can use my email also if you have any questions. I might take some time to answer, but I will answer. And now we choose our package we need. We have a 64 bit system of Ubuntu. So I click on this package and we say save file. As you can see, it's about 325 megabytes in size. It's quite big. And as you can see, I'm, I've already received my email with all the download links and if you move down here's a product key this beta will expire on the 20 i believe the 24th of january so it's quite soon today is the 11th so, as you can see, I'm just going to save the product key now, for later, and I'm just going to save it. So basically, SoftMaker, it is not free, this version. If you go to stable, don't, don't get alarm and turn it off now, <laughs> because it's not free, I will give you hope. Very soon, as you can see, it looks very well, and the, the price is oh, this is oh, this is this is in rubles now, so it's slightly difficult for me to say, but it's like 70 80 bucks, so it is a bit of money. But they also got Sort Maker, also got a free version, which is fantastic. So, I thought make the same free offers so that's fantastic and currently the stable version is 2016 and they also got office 2016 also you need to get a product key but it's all free so on free so free of soft of soft maker free offers everything is for free it is just they got a paid version and the non Papers. I'm not exactly sure what the difference is, but I'm sure that when 2018 comes out, it will be here also. So you can type in your name, choose country, email, download Linux, and that's basically all you have to do. And then you can get it. And you will also get a product here, as I said, but it's fantastic that they get a free version also. So the beta. There's only beat, one beta for both of them because it's also free. So, as you can see, it's still downloading. What I like about this office, I love Lava Office. I'm a daily or a regular user of Lava Office. And it's fantastic. I love it. The problem with it, it comes when there's very specific, difficult documents made in office sometimes it struggles to open it correctly it doesn't look at all the presentations you have to move things around to make it look nice where i downloaded this presentation here and we will try to open it up and you will see it is exactly how it is in microsoft office so it's very they claim to be 100% compatible with Microsoft Office and it's actually true what I've tested so far. 
So I didn't test it completely, but what I tested, what I tested is pretty much exactly what we want. So that's definitely a place for it. It's made in Germany. So that's the Oregon, and as you can see, we already nearly downloaded everything, which is quite amazing. And depending on your internet speed, this might take quicker, it might take slower. I won't fast forward this video now because it's basically done. <laughs> so that's fantastic. So yeah. So now we can just go to our download folder. And you can close the browser. Now we can just, you can install it with your default software install, but I'm going to give you an alternative way if it doesn't work like it. So I'm going to click inside the directory where this package is, and I'm going to say open in terminal. As you can see, downloads, downloads, we're in the right place. Now I'm going to type in sudo, you will find this command in, in the description of this video. tpkg minus sign i, and I'm going to copy this whole name. So I'm going to say rename, press control A to get this last piece also, control C. So we have this name copied and we're just going to paste it straight into our terminal, press enter. Type in a computer password, and as you can see, it's busy installing the package. It might take a few minutes, so I'm gonna fast forward this part, and I will see you soon. As you can see, we're basically finishing up now with the installation, and that's pretty neat or I think we are finishing up now <laughs> <laughs> so basically as you can see it's done and it installed everything everything correctly and we can just close everything let's restart later and now we can go to our menu or our search, and we can say free maker as you can see plan maker is like excel Let's open it up. So it's slightly different names. Let's get our product key ready. And copy it in. Okay, so let's not close it. And now you can choose between layout you want. So the first one is a ribbon and the rest is classic like 2016. So let's take the green one. And now they say it will expire on the 24th and then we should have a stable release. And now we have to paste our product key, the one they sent us. And there we go. So it looks pretty much like Microsoft Office. And for some people this will be awesome. So that's great. And let's go to some of our others. Let's go to all. So they got the Excel presentation as well as a text editor, so basically we already choose the theme for your role, so when we choose the first theme, and as you can see it looks very familiar, and let's go for the last one, the in red text maker, <laughs> it's quite funny. I would thought it would be blue. <laughs> and yeah, it looks great, it looks well, it looks familiar. 
and I can see why many people will, many people will like it. So if we close this up and we go to our presentation. And we open it up. Okay, let's open it up first in Library Office. I don't like to compare Office Suites with, with one another. Because I love Library Office and I don't want to put it in bad light. But it will be maybe good for some of you to see what is, if it's really better or not. So let's look if this is just a fantastic one or like here the picture is too big as you can see you will have to tinker with the picture and this is slide 10 it's nothing big we can easily do it but it's not perfect so let's select presentation 2018 And let's go to slide 10. And as you can see, totally different. Isn't that great? So it makes everything like it should be out of the box and thumbs up for that. Yeah, so that's basically my look and I think I'm pretty impressed. Thank you for watching. See you later. Goodbye.